respect the person, not the title. How many times have you seen people who, when they're around the big boss, right, the owner of the company, CEO, or anybody else in the C-suite, their colleagues, peers, or above, they're extremely nice, they look helpful, smile on their face, they try to do whatever they can to be around the CEO in their presence, whether it's he or she, it doesn't matter. They try to, um, you know, compliment that individual consistently, and so forth. And then when they're not in that same environment, they're somewhere else, with their team or with other folks who are organizationally lower than they may be, but by no means less important, but organizationally lower. They are rude, obnoxious, mean, abusive, right? They're bullying and bulldogging others. How often have you seen that? Because I have. Over the last 20 plus years, I've seen a number of people like that. And trust me when I tell you, when it comes to the long game of life and career, people like that will almost always lose. I say almost always because sometimes they will come across a, a, a CEO who likes people around them like that or likes people around her like that who are consistently looking up and saying, you are so amazing, you're so wonderful, you're so great, right? Where would we be without you and your leadership? Real, true leaders despise people like that. So, just a quick video to reflect on things I've seen over the years and I've seen again over the last couple weeks. And I, um, I wonder if you have experienced the same. Those who are nice, helpful, collaborative team players, when they're around the top or on the leadership of that company, and they're completely different when they're around everybody else. As always, if this is the first video you see, please consider subscribing and sharing it with your friends and colleagues. And most importantly, leave your thoughts and comments below as to what have your experiences been thus far. Have a great day, enjoy it, and make sure you do whatever you can at least make a day of one person better because of your presence. Have a wonderful day.